he pulls back his arm and he slaps Chris Rock across the face. And I don't even know. At that point, you don't even know what's happening. You don't even know if you push the shutter or not. I'm Robin Beck, and I'm a photographer for AFP in Los Angeles. Been with AFP for 30 years, covering all sorts of different news events. For us, the highlight of the entire entertainment season in Los Angeles is the Oscars. It still holds the glamour of old Hollywood, and I've covered the Oscars many, many times. 2022 was the most memorable Oscars I ever covered. And that was because of the famous photo which I took, which you might have seen, which is the photo of Will Smith slapping Chris Rock. One of the hard things about the Oscars is you need to be super attentive at all moments. There's very often an event that will happen on stage during the three and a half hour show that is kind of a, a fake spontaneous event. You're really focused, always paying attention. You never know what to expect. I was watching uh, Chris Rock doing a monologue. All of a sudden, Will Smith yelled something from the audience and started walking onto the stage. So this is a pretty unusual thing, but like I said, it could be a fake spontaneous event. You can hear the anger in Will Smith's voice, but you don't know what's gonna happen. I still had in my head that it was a, a gag, but I'm also paying attention because you don't know when the gag's gonna happen. And Will Smith walks up and he pulls back his arm and he slaps Chris Rock across the face. And I don't even know. At that point, you don't even know what's happening. You don't even know if you push the shutter or not. You just hope you are on autopilot just from doing this for 30 years. Even though no one said a word, you can feel this very scared, quiet energy and people don't know what's going on. But, and I was scared because I don't know if I got the picture. So this is probably one of the biggest pictures of my career. It's gonna be used more than anything else and I don't even know if I got it. And when I looked back on the camera, I saw that I had the picture and that was a relief. I also saw I didn't have the contact, but the crazy thing was no one had contact on that picture. It's probably because no one predicted that that was what was gonna happen. Even among these photographers, and there's six or seven of us up in there from the top news agencies, it's a very exclusive position. And yet no one got it because no one could have imagined. Even though the camera can shoot 20 frames a second, we cannot shoot that many frames a second. We have to be present enough to feel what's gonna happen next. Because if, if I shot 20 frames per second for three hours, you would, need hundreds of photo editors to edit that quickly because we need to get the quick pictures out quickly. It did become a kind of viral on the internet. It became a meme, became a birthday card. The thing about the job, regardless if, if you're covering entertainment or political events or natural disasters or human disasters, it's about being present in that moment where you're actually focused on what's happening right in front of you and around you regardless of what you're shooting. Even though I felt it was a negative event, it created a dialogue about uh, mental health. It's a big part of Oscar, Oscar's history. I'm grateful to have been there and grateful that I had the experience and the training and the presence to capture the moment. <laughs>